the Google Play Store application. So click on it and then search. And in search, you're going to type in here draft. So D R A U as this draft here, and then click on search. All right, so um, here you're going to have list of drafts. I'm still having someone here uh, sending me this, uh, Christian. Christian, hold up, I'm coming. So here you just have to navigate to where you have draft uh, 10. There's this draft 10 by 10 board. There's this one here that I'm highlighting. All right, so uh, click on it and download. So when you click on it, I've already downloaded and installed it. So it's that is what I'm having here play. So this is it here. So when you install it, uh, we have it here in our app icon. This is the app icon here. So when you click on it, uh, this is what shows up. Now, if you take a look at this uh, formation here, you could see that the orientation of the board is uh, not what we, uh, we, the West African players, are used to. Uh, let's say Nigerian or Ghana I used to you could see the diagonal is at the right at the left hand side right so the diagonal is at the left hand side and then this is not what we're used to so I, I'm going to show you real quick on how to change uh, this orientation to that which we are conversant with and also um, um, disable the maximum capturing um, group so uh, quickly you want to head over to settings so click on settings now you can see here maximum capturing is enabled as it is ticked um uh, christian don't worry you're going to play me i'm making a video all right so don't worry okay okay so sorry about that so um you want to uncheck uncheck the maximum capturing and then you're going to check the flip horizontally so on checking the maximum capturing we disable the maximum capturing um, rule and then checking the flip horizontal this is going to change the orientation of the board and make it that which we are conversant with so you want to click ok on this so when you click ok um yours let me go back to settings yours the level of difficulty you can see here i'm just toggling it left and right uh, the level of difficulty might be somewhere between this if you are installing the application newly if you want to play with the computer you want to set it to hard so just drag it to this hard level all right so uh, make sure that your um what do i say your settings is like this all right um if you want to enable numbers these numbers here let me just play with that real quick if you check it and click OK, you will see the numbers here showing on the board. All right, so you have numbers here showing on the board. Uh, I don't want that for now. All right, and then click OK. You could pretty much play with the settings, but make sure that the flip horizontal horizontally is checked and then the maximum capturing is disabled and then click OK. So right now you could see that the board, I have my um, diagonal here at the right hand side, which is what we are conversant with. Okay, so that being said, uh, quickly, let's, if you want to play with the computer, you do all this, you play, go ahead and play with the computer. But if you want to play with your friend online, uh, your colleague somewhere um, that's far away from you, um, please pretty much head on to new, right? So click on this new or the play button here below at the, the left hand side below to see it here highlighted all right so click on it and then you want to click on this private room that's this one in the middle so we're going to click on this okay so when you click on this um you have the ability to create room as you're creating a room between let's say i'm playing Amor tanker that's one of the best players in nigeria with so many titles Let's say I want to play him, or I want to play the national champion Dobra, or one of the, or I want to play the FCT current champion Lucky, uh, Lucky John, or I want to play General, one of the best players in Atiyanya, um, Abuja. Uh, let's say I want to play any of those players. All right, so you want to head over. Let me just go back real quick. So click on New, and then tap this middle um, where you have multiple individuals here so tap the private room 
So when you tap the private room, the first thing you want to do, you want to create a room ID, more like a hotel room or a room, an enclosed room where both of you can play your draft game together. So I'm going to click on the input room ID. So, so clicking on this, you are enabling, you're going to create um, a room ID for both of you. All right, so um, here you can pretty much put in any number that you can recall. All right, I can say 500, all right, or 500, 50. It pretty much accepts numbers. I don't think it accepts, it doesn't accept characters. So you can't say this versus this. So I'm typing here characters is not showing up. So this basically accepts only numbers. So I'm just going to say five or let's just say any number at all. Just come back here, 332, 3334, or 3333, whatever as the case may be, any random number, just type in here. So when you're satisfied with the number you have in here, just click on add. You can see the private room here, 33. So the next thing you want to do here is, um, let's say you want to invite your friend, okay, to this room. So what you want to do is to click on invite friend. So I'm going to click on this invite friend. So when you click on invite friend, you're going to have these uh, options to copy this link. So I'm going to copy this link here. So you can see here, link copied. All right, so next thing I want to do is to send the link over to my friend. So I'm going to do in this our platform, that's the Nyanya Mopo field. So I'm going to click on this. And then here, I'm going to paste the link here. I just created a new ID, a new room. So whoever I send this to, uh, please make sure you don't send it to multiple individuals, just one-on-one -on -one player. All right, so whoever clicks it, the link here. So once you click the link, once your um, your colleague clicks the link, you, if he's not having the application, it's going to ask him to install the application first. Um, then make sure that you describe how the person is going to configure the um, the application to suit your own need. And then after this is done, let me just click on this. It's going to bring this. So I'm going to click on play. Then here, uh, when you click on new, the next thing you're going to do is to click this offline. So we click on this offline, you're going to have this online ability to click online. So we click on the online here, make sure you sign in as guests, all right? Sign in as guests. So I'm going to click on that. Okay, so when you click on the guest, um, click on the guest here, then click on the private room, then um, probably you go to the um, new room, no, not new room, uh, match opponent. So make sure you click on the match opponent. So as you click on the match opponent, let me disable this. So once your um, your a colleague has downloaded the application using the link. Make sure you click on the new. I think I'm having um, this ad advert popping up. Yes. Okay, continue. So um, here in the private, make sure you click both of you, that's you and your opponent. Let me go back again. So when your opponent has downloaded the application and made all that installed using the link you provided, uh, make sure you click on the private room, then click on match opponent. All right. And the ID is going to be the same. That's the same ID you created. All right. So that's um, the, the room ID. Make sure this one at the top, that's the private room at the top. Make sure it's the same ID with the ID you sent to your colleague, all right? Then click match opponent. So when you click match opponent and your opponent click match opponent, it's going to synchronize together and both of you can start playing. All right, so um, let me pause this one real quick. I hope I got this correctly.